Hey guys and welcome in to a review of the, well, SanDisk Sansa. Uh, this is a very small MP3 device and I picked this up um, quite a few years ago now but I've only just got around to using it properly. I think I use it in college quite a bit and uh, I now have it here and it, uh, I basically I've sold my iPod. I had to due to money issues and buying a couple of new games which I'll do videos on soon um, but yeah this is this is the Sansa as you can kind of see there's some kind of aspects to it which look very iPod and that is of course the spinny wheel in the middle and it's going to focus in here so you can actually see that um, you've got your back menu uh, forwards and pause and play and you've got a home button so let's hit the home button here you've got a nice menu system here uh, basically it gives you every option possible uh, you've got settings which basically has everything in it from audiobooks photos radios um, system settings music options that kind of thing um, this has I think two or four gigabytes of memory on board so this thing can hold quite a bit and it's also on the side got a um, hold and uh, off power button and also a micro SD card which is always definitely nice and handy to have the ability to put one in um, so yeah I'm gonna show you a couple of features here it's got voice as well which is amazing so you can actually record like notes and the, the microphone is as maybe is as good or maybe better than the iPod uh, touch which I use for my old vlogs um, which is bloody amazing to be honest uh, uh, really really good FM radio works amazingly well uh, picks up stations really well um, and is just absolutely fantastic has the ability to record as well which is really cool for such a small device I got this for about 30 pounds about three years ago so you're looking at quite a price now uh, of, of only about a tenner maybe less if you can even pick these up anymore um, be it FM radio, complete FM radio, what it needs is the headset plugged into it and you can and you're on the go. Uh, no speaker built into this annoyingly, so I can't let you listen to anything. Um, videos and photos, so I've got uh, photos here, uh, I've got artwork, um, let's show you the uh, here the kid. here's um seldom seen kid, uh, and it shows the Pope pictures and I put those on there so the so the, uh, so the the device recognizes it and can use it for the stuff. And yeah, you can see there that the, the screen quality is actually really, really nice. Um, amazingly good colours on the screen. Uh, it's actually better in person than it is on here, but it really, really crisp screen on it, uh, which is really, really nice. Um, uh, so yeah, and you've got a full like photo album system here. You've got albums, you've got everything you could ever possibly want on here. Um, and yeah, you can basically make albums, put them on there and they take JPEGs, everything else, so you've got a big, big list of different uh, big different files you can use for this thing. Uh, moving down onto videos, uh, it does play video, you can put uh, um, AVI, uh, I don't think MP4 works, I've tried putting MP4 on there before and it didn't do anything. Uh, what I've got here is an old review, of one of my first reviews on YouTube, and this is of Grand Theft Auto 4, I did uh, on the Nokia, th um, one of the Nokias, one of the newer Nokias, but not the, not the ancient one, but yeah. Um, as you can see, the, the, the screen quality is really nice. It has a very good uh, screen on it, so you can even turn it around almost completely and it doesn't disappear. Um, as you can see, the quality, that's, that's the quality of the camera, not the quality of the, uh, the screen. Um, th those lines came up because I was recording a CRT TV. This is back in, what, 2009? Um, so yeah. Uh, yeah, so there you can see that the, the, the quality of the video is really nice. Um, and I can try and show you another video to maybe put it across more. I've got a ton of stuff on here um, that I've got off like YouTube over the years and I used to take to college and stuff like that. Um, let's show you uh, Tekken. Uh, this is one of the trailers for Tekken 5 or the intro video and as you can see it runs smoothly it runs really nicely it's a bit compressed uh, you can tell but once you're watching it you forget that and you can just watch the videos with no issues at all. Um, so yeah, amazingly well, cool. Um, music now. This is called. This is another amazing uh, features and stuff on here. It has like separate playlists and it has separate gaps for audiobooks and podcasts. So I put podcasts in there. Michael Groff show. Check it out. Type it on on Google. Um, 
and as you can see here it gives it the date of the of the uh, of the of the file itself start that from the beginning and you can see there it starts and plays um, and of course there's no sound as I said before um, but you can turn the wheel right now and what it will show you is the volume will go up and down if you turn it and you can also pause by pressing up um, yeah so that's the Sansa by SanDisk I really recommend getting one of these if you are looking for a small portable uh, mp3 player the Sansa by SanDisk is absolutely a mind blowing for the price, um, and still it still kind of like interests me now in the terms of its features. Check it out. Also check out Steve Benway uh, did a video uh, responding to my my last uh, weekend topic. I'm sorry there wasn't a weekend topic today. I've been quite busy. Uh, there will be hopefully one tomorrow. I'm not sure what's happening. But yeah, thanks for watching. But until next time, it's me out. Uh